Hi everyone in Brick Code Lab. I'm very excited because LEGO released ED3 Classroom software. I was not a fan of the ED3 programmer software because building code from left to right is totally strange to me. Mm, that's why I have always tried to use uh, Scratch, but ED3 module to Scratch is very limited. It doesn't support gyro or infrared sensor, a color sensor only detect brightness and many others. Now we have EV Classroom, which looks like Scratch, and I'm very happy. Thank you, LEGO. Today I will try to show you a simple use of EV Classroom to rotate the motors. EV3 motors you can run by blue blocks. You can run motors clockwise or counterclockwise. You can run it for seconds, rotations and degrees. You can set motor speed from 1 to 100. Now let's try to use a motor with a shooter mechanism. To shoot the ball you must rotate small gear about 320 degrees counterclockwise. The motor moves the piston which pushes the ball to the launcher. Then you must take the piston back. Let's build a code. If you want a burst shooting, you must use a loop which repeats the code three times. You can use event to program a shooter to shoot when you press a brick button. You can also use a touch sensor to shoot. Remember that you must select port which the touch sensor is connected to. Instead of the event, you can use a sensor block and loop forever. The building instruction of the shooter you can find on my replicable profile. In the next videos I will use a shooter with a turntable and track vehicle. So don't forget to subscribe and see you soon.